Eyewitness Weather Forecast. Well, good morning. Much more cloud cover to start off our day today and a few passing showers, if not a couple pockets of drizzle as we're headed out the door this morning. So have the umbrella handy, but it's not something that'll be needed all day today. Let's take a step outside with radar from Hills Grove, Laporte, just south of Dew Shore, Benton, east of Picture Rocks and Hughesville, Harvey's Lake, Tunkanic, the Back Mountain at most. It's a light shower at the very least. It's a few pockets of drizzle, maybe just some raindrops here and there. This is nothing that's causing us any major problems for the morning commute. We throw things in motion. You can really see just how spotty all of this is, but everybody is going to get to see something today, whether it's one or two raindrops this morning or a quick little shower. This is all very quick moving, so most of this will be done by the late morning. We'll actually be able to enjoy some more sunshine moving into the afternoon. All in all, to mild start, Hazleton 45, Mount Pocono 46, Wilkes-Barre and Scranton 49, and Pottsville coming in right around the mid 40s. We are headed back into the 60s today, so it's going to be another warm day, but for that morning commute, just have the umbrella ready. Give it to the kids as they're going to the bus stop by this afternoon. We'll have that sunshine to look forward to, and you can really see by the time we get to the start of the afternoon, the bulk of those showers have already tapered off. Is one or two showers going to be in the cards going into the afternoon? Absolutely. It's something that just simply can't be ruled out. The atmosphere is a little bit more unsettled today. I'm thinking if anywhere, it'll be in parts of central Pennsylvania. The farther east we are today, we'll actually end up seeing more sunshine. So not a bad Tuesday or Wednesday, Wednesday afternoon. That's ahead of us. But there are those showers with the bigger picture, mostly in central Pennsylvania. And even that being said, those look pretty isolated for the most part. Quiet overnight tonight and looks like a pretty quiet day tomorrow as well. This area of high pressure is going to hold off the showers from this frontal system as we go through our Thursday afternoon and really into our Friday as well. As this front marches to the east, we do see more cloud cover on Friday. There will be a pop up shower Friday afternoon, but even much of Friday, if not for some of us, all of the day. Looks like it'll stay dry and the same goes for Saturday. We have lingering cloud cover Saturday. We're not ruling out a shower in the afternoon, but the more organized round of rain is still off to our west. That is going to move in on Sunday. So for the weekend right now, looking ahead, it looks like Sunday is going to be the wetter of the two days. Saturday looking like the better day. Mid 60s for the high today in your eyewitness weather forecast. A few showers mostly this morning, though one or two can't be ruled out this afternoon. Clouds will then break for sunshine through the second part of our day today. Tonight will fall to the 40s, 68 tomorrow. It's a very nice Thursday as we mix clouds and sun. Friday looking for that isolated shower, the same thing on Saturday. But like I said, both days look mostly dry. Sunday will have more scattered showers at 64. Monday, the cloud cover lingers right at 60, but we do get another dry break on Monday before a few showers move back in on Tuesday. And we can always download the eyewitness weather.